This game is rated M and is intended for mature audiences. Hey there, Adi! Uh, I object already because I know it's gonna be crazy. Our voices rain out in unison. Go fish! Hey! Finally! How about we just open a new pack? Well, that was fair. Just to be safe, everyone check the cards. They're gonna secretly put their own tiny little marks on them, aren't they? Because these people are patently insane. I'm president. Another standard card game. First one to get rid of all their cards wins. The basic rules play a better card than the one before. You can play straights in pairs. There are various techniques that improve games like reversals. But because it's such a well-known game, there are lots of house rules for it as well. The name, for example. In my hometown, we called it Millionaire. Thank you for confirming all these house rules. While I was confirming the familiar rules, Satoko looked over at me cautiously. I probably should have tried to look more like an amateur. I was pretty used to this game. It's president, and it's with a new deck. Today, I might be able to win. I had the gist of the rules now. But that wasn't everything, was it? Let's not play with penalties. Because it's stupid. That's genius, but also I don't approve of the whole penalty thing. Oh, that seemed like it could be interesting. Satoko, that's definitely a fake laugh if I've ever heard one. No! Oh, like, come on, you all knew I wasn't really laughing at that. It's true. Maybe this is the way to do it. <laughs> wow. Mm hmm. Mion handed out several slips of paper to everybody. Now then, what would be a good penalty? Do I get to actually make any choices in this visual novel? I just realized we haven't made any choices yet. Worst case scenario, you draw what you wrote. Something too intense would be like digging your own grave. That is true. Hey, I can write what I want, Rika. Rika-chan's casual suggestion caused Mion's hand to lurch to a sudden halt. Uh-huh. I see. Just in case you lost, you'd just grab the note with the folded corner and you'd be safe. That was a good idea. Diabolical as ever, Mion. Rika-chan was quite formidable too, being able to see through that. I couldn't underestimate her, even though she doesn't stand out. Also, you should not be allowed to look at what you're picking. If you're truly drawing from a hat, you don't get to look at what's inside. You just grab a paper and you pull it out. And I, yes, Rena. How about we just play for fun? Can we just have fun and enjoy each other's company? Nobody agreed to Rena's proposal. Everyone was ruthless. It's not good to have less of Roof. Roof is great. She makes the best bread. Rana was quite brutal, even though she usually appeared meek. Better not underestimate her, either. 
told you, everybody's crazy here. Oh, so the penalty can't just be like, if you draw this, then Keiichi needs to do this, even if he wasn't the loser. Like, you can't do that. How do you know this, Rika? Are you, sp are you using Arthur's mirrors? I still didn't know what Rika-chan's penalties would be like. We all nodded determinedly. Having confirmed that, Mion dealt out the cards. Finally, this battle begins. I had a decent starting hand. Card after card was played in the middle. Not needing Mion to tell them, both Rikachan and Satoko played their cards without hesitation. Rena and I were the only ones who paused to think. It seemed that Rena genuinely couldn't make up her mind, but I was different. I was like a shark stalking its prey, just waiting for the right time to strike. <laughs> Sorry, Mion. Tough luck, kid. <laughs> the loser of the first round was, of all people, Mion. And now I was certain. Today, I could win. <laughs> Mion, accepting her defeat, scrounged around inside the bag and pulled out one piece of paper. Uh oh. You're in trouble. You're. This was your idea, Mion, so this is all on you. Mion quivered and shrieked. <laughs> Rana was also surprised when she peeked at it. What kind of terrible thing was written on it? Pet the principal on the head. What? Just <laughs> wait. Uh-oh. That's, that's just evil. Satoko yelled with a serious look on her face. But she wasn't as loud as Mion's shriek. What could it be? <laughs> oh, you are so dead, Mion! Now see, this is an anime that I would watch. <laughs> you have to touch the principal's head, but defend yourself from his martial arts. Wow! He was inhuman. Pet that guy's head? Are you allowed to swap for something different? <sighs> We better get a CG of this. She bellowed out a yell as she dashed down the hallway. Okay, the principal is a human, not a Superman. I could do nothing but wait with bated breath. Kerpow! A rumble shook the classroom. <laughs> what is happening? What the heck? Is he actually beating up a student? <laughs> Following the launcher of a jab, jab, strong, fierce combo. <laughs> Power dunk! <laughs> He's even using meter! <laughs> Can we have the principal in the next Smash Bros. game? I will also accept Tomoyo. Nothing I could do except stay calm. I understood now why there were no delinquents at this school. After a few moments of silence, Mion slumped back to us. Should have let one of us see it. Mion said that before collapsing. Yeah, that was just rude. Also, I think that might have been Rika who put that down. 
I was amazed the person who made club activities like these could say that. Oh, well, you don't know if that's the worst one. Rena tried to lighten the mood and was only met with Mion's malicious grin. She was serious now. The pace of the game became bizarrely quick. I could tell the game had gotten more intense. <laughs> I've never seen this face before. What does it look like in the different art styles? Okay. <laughs> She's just like, hey, you're going down, Buster. <laughs> and then here it just looks like she's hitchhiking. Cool. Uh-oh, sorry, Rena. And the heavens chose to vanquish Rena. <laughs> Give Keiichi a hug. It wasn't exactly hard for her to be worried. Just thinking of the level of difficulty of Mion's first penalty still made me quiver. And so, the penalty she drew with trembling fingers was... The heck was this? Speak like a maid. What does that even mean? Don't maids just speak normally like everybody else? Easiest penalty. Just talk in your normal language and it should be fine. Who wrote that one? Oh, you have to call everyone master? That's weird. Real maids don't do that. I don't know what maids you're working with, but um, maids don't call people master, at least here in the Americas. They had hit me like a tonne of bricks. I had no idea who wrote that penalty, but she was awesome! I could just die right now. Okay, bro. Keep, keep it in your pants. The eagerness to which I was gouting Rena into addressing me as master was downright impressive, if I do say so myself. No, not again! Rana again? What kind of penalty would it be this time? I was delighted by the mysterious sense of anticipation. Anticipation? No, this was conviction! Remove one item of clothing from the top and bottom halves of your- EXCUSE ME! Whoever wrote that, you are going to hell. Also, some people only wear one level of clothing. Well, I guess two levels on the bottom, but still, that you can't do that. It, this is a public place. My face reddened in anger. If I didn't yell something out, I wouldn't be able to hide my shaking. <sighs> Who did write that? God, please give that man a Nobel Prize! <laughs> Not good, not good! What was I thinking about what was written on my face? <sighs> Renan begged Mion with teary eyes, but everyone knew Mion's answer already. Um... I know this is rated M, but if we're going the nudity route, then I, I will switch over to the black screen. Because, uh, we don't allow that, even if the game is rated M. <laughs> Can somebody please put a stop to this, like, martial arts principal master? Uh-uh, this is real bad. What?! I looked around thinking someone else would probably stop her. Of course, I wasn't exactly trying to stop her either. 
Then I heard the rustling of clothing, the sound of her skirt hitting the ground, and set my heart... This is bad. This is real bad. This is real bad. I looked away like a gentleman. Good on you, KG. But these club activities, you needed to be ruthless after all. Uh, oh, thank goodness. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Thank you, Big Brain Rena, for being like, I bet someone's going to be a pervert and do that. I was not expecting her to be wearing her PE outfit underneath her school outfit. Uh, I don't know if you're making me... If you're making people take a beating from the martial arts principle, I, nothing's nothing's off limits. Satoko poked fun at me right now, but I can't hear it. No. Her squirming around in her PE clothes makes it impossible for me to not feel anything. Well, this is weird. And uncomfortable. <clears throat> Calm down, Keiji Maibara. Mion probably wrote that one and planned to go after me as I panicked. You can't fall for a trap after knowing it's a trap. Clear your head. Calm down and assess the situation. I was determined to think my way out of this. And the answer was quite simple. I then became a god! Okay, I, who had already entered the domain of godhood, what would dare stand in my way? Bro, if you call yourself god, you're gonna regret it. It was like they were pulled to me magnetically. I was picking up aces and twos like nobody's business! <laughs> Satoko has my luck. Who wrote that one? <laughs> These are stupid. <laughs> oh, no. Yes, the pleasure of making this brat disgrace herself. Rude. <laughs> Keiichi's on an unstoppable winning streak. See? This is what happens when we actually play on equal footing. That is very rude. Yes! Mion's despair was like, Sweet honey! <laughs> okay, are we sure that Keiji's not cheating at this point? Um, why does Keiji keep getting to draw them? Yeah, this is weird. I don't like this. She's not wearing a skirt, so it's her bare legs. <laughs> this is very uncomfortable. <laughs> Bro, if you are caught cheating... Actually, no, they say you can do whatever you want to if it means winning. So, if we're cheating, then it's actually okay, apparently. <laughs> Bro, you're terrible. I had transformed into an evil dictator and couldn't be doing any better. It felt like I could control how the cards played out with my mind and even decide what suits would appear just by willing it. By the time I realized it, I had already assembled a harem. Yeah, that's not good. Like, that's not something to aspire to, bruh. I was laughing haughtily as I rested my head on Rena, who is now a bloomer-clad bloomer maid. Uh-huh. That's very, very creepy. Satoko was wearing a collar and had taken on a little sister properties. Mion was fanning me while wearing a school swimsuit. What about Rika? <laughs> I began to think, why does man have no end to his desires? How could I wish for more than this palace of dreams? 
<laughs> Rika also apparently hasn't lost yet. That was it. Rika chan hadn't been in first, but she continued to escape being in last. Come on, let, let Rika go. Well, funny you should say that. <laughs> exactly. This is... This is not okay. <laughs> is this the part where Rika pulls out a knife and shows she's crazy? Oh, please. Rika-chan said that in her usual calm manner with a cheery tone. This was undoubtedly a declaration of war. Oh, brother. <sighs> they even they actually even drew a new art for her. Wow. <laughs> they literally just did a simple Photoshop job over there. Such stoicism from this little girl who's always hidden away in S hiding away in Satoko's shadow. It would probably be rude not to meet her head on. I shall face you myself, little one. I saw Mion swap a few cards with Rikachan in the middle of the game, but pretended I didn't see it. Do you believe you can defeat Keiji Sama with just that? <laughs> Everyone looked over at me. I was still brimming with confidence. <laughs> the four of them have allied against me. That's it? You're making me laugh. <laughs> Satoko let out a shriek. <laughs> you simpletons! Using up all of her cards before calling the reversal left Rika Chan with no good cards! She was defeated soon after. <laughs> she looks so sad! <laughs> Aww. Very disappoint. Alright. Wear cat ears, a bell collar, and a tail. What? What kind of a weirdo is putting up these punishments? <laughs> Even the penalties were as I wished. You wrote those down, Keiichi? You disgusting But Rika chan hung her neck and equipped the free holy artifacts. It's questionable as to why these fiends were in Mion's locker, but since I had no objections, I didn't ask. Uh-huh. And why did you want this? Ooh. This was so... Yeah. Felt like I'd become Rena. This was definitely cute. That wasn't me talking, that was the actual Rena. Me. As Rikachan mimicked a cat, that's not mimicking a cat at all. <laughs> Just go meep. It's like that's not what a cat sounds like. Rains of smoke escaped from Rena's ears with an audible poof. I mean, I mean this punishment is definitely less stupid than some of the other ones, but. Okay, I believe you. <laughs> Mion gasped and dropped her fist into her open palm. Jeez. Dangerous promise. They thought that Rena in cute mode would be able to defeat me. Would it be that easy? Opposing me was the same as opposing God! I teach them their place. Oh, I really hope Cage he gets put in his place. He's his ego is out the window. 
<laughs> For a moment, I didn't know what was going on. The 52 cards danced and flowed freely between Rena's hands like the machinations of a master magician. In the middle of those flowing cards was Rena's ecstatic expression, her head bobbing around. My whole body knew it already. I was... going to lose. You know, I can't help but feel like this was a bit of a conspiracy. Everyone cheered. I was spent. <laughs> Brain it. Everyone peeked at it in unison, gazes flickering between the text and my face. <laughs> <laughs> you also have to pet the principal's head. No! <laughs> you can't do that. Every penalty up until now. That's not one penalty. <laughs> That's not one penalty. Boo! Boo! <laughs> These people are the worst. I'm including Keiichi in this as well. Does this mean we have to pet the principal's head while wearing a girl swimsuit and cat ears? Ugh. Rena passed out with a squeal, blood spewing from her nose like a fountain. That's not how nosebleeds work! <laughs> My dignity was being trampled more than a communal doormat. Again, this is not one punishment, so these people are the, were the worst. Satoko was like a lone shark. Actually, me trying to escape reality as fast as humanly possible was a pretty adorable, if I do say so myself. The executioners surrounded me, wagging their fingers. Yeah, yeah, that was not very enjoyable. Can we get to the horror stuff already? Good lord! My first thought, it's tight around the waist. Second thought, the chest area was pretty loose. Third thought, the crotch area was... <laughs> yeah, uh, we better not be getting a CG of this. I normally make the CGs the thumbnails, I would not make that the thumbnail. No, I really don't. I think I'd rather deck you all. The stern, scientific, calculating nature mixed in with her fascination made me own very scary. Yeah, 
行で下校するってのもあればよかったですのに<笑>じゃあも,もういいかい着替えてさ Yeah, this is just. I feel like every visual novel is just unnecessarily raunchy. If I make a visual novel, I promise you it will not be raunchy. This is Artie's sole promise. While I was saying that, Mion placed her hands around my shoulders and Rika chan slipped up behind me without a sound. <laughs> I was joking about that. Rika chan patted my head without saying a word. <sighs> When will I learn my lesson to just stop playing visual novels? They always turn out like this. Always. <sighs> I stepped forwards into the principal's office. My bell collar jingled adorably. The principal froze solid with a smile on his face as he saw me. I couldn't blame him. In this sacred place of study, specifically in his office, though I said excuse me as I entered, the sight of a person entering with a school swimsuit, cat ears, a collar, and a tail, and for it to be a young male student. Without a doubt, any normal person's psyche would have stopped cold. But this could be explained. We will call it Uncanny Valley Camouflage, if you will. When humans see each other, they can only begin to act after committing this is confirming this is human. Meaning that if he could not comprehend what was in front of him, then in those moments before he could begin to fully process the situation, his mind was completely blank! This was my one and only chance for victory. My penalty. Rubbing the principal's head. <laughs> Yeesh, way too screamy. A Jane sound echoed loudly. He went straight for the special move? The principal said one thing to me. That's a very good question. And in a heartbeat. <laughs> principal for Smash. That tremor resounded throughout the Hinamizawan twilight. Can we not have another scene like that? That was very uncomfortable. Can we get to the murder already? Good lord. Artie wants blood!